The 111th of Paris-Roubaix to 2013 was over 255 kilometers. And although the weather looked nice, it was extremely cold. The riders making their traditional start and covering nearly 50 kilometers in the opening hour, which meant that 13 riders who got themselves into the front never gained more than about 35 seconds over the field. As always in Paris-Roubaix, there are the crashes, and there was none uh, worse looking than that of Johan Ofredo, who at kilometre 123, a little inattention looking over his shoulder, and he hit a central reservation barrier. He retired from the race with a cut face. Even Andre Greipel tried to reach a four lone breakaways of Stegman, Stuart O'Grady, Matty Heyman and Koretsky, and even though he couldn't get up to them, they did stay away for a long time. A lone pursuit was started by Michael Schaar of Team BMC from Switzerland. And finally, four riders came together at the front, Stegmans and Heyman being joined by Goda and Michael Schaar. While Fabian Cancellara was left to do a lot of chasing himself behind, Cancellara was attacking at 23 kilometers out and he was being joined by Zdenik Steibar, the Czech Republic cyclocross rider who just sat on his back wheel as he was towed across to the leaders. At Sector 4, at the California de Larbe, this is where we would have expected Cancellara to make the move, but instead, although he was with the leaders, there was drama, as the Omega Farmer quick-step rider, Stein Vandenberg, who had appeared strong throughout, caught his front wheel on the edge of the cobbles and went down with a bang. And then, 14 kilometres out to the finish, almost an identical crash as the Denik Steibar also crashed at a similar point. They were both away from the front group now. The two most dangerous riders to affect Cancellara had literally crashed out. And now it was left to the newcomer on the block, Set Van Mark, to work steadily with Fabian Cancellara. And although at four kilometres to go, Cancellara launched an enormous attack. Did he break the spirit of the Belgian youngster? No, he did not. And so Set Van Mark managed to hang on, which left, led to which led to the inevitable finish. It was Fabian Cancellara who confirmed himself as a three-time winner of Paris-Roubaix. And as he said afterwards, this was his best victory of all three. Set Van Mark has become a new name on the future, being such a young age of 24. In the sprint for third place, it was Nicky Terpstra, the champion of Holland, who took that out.